Good morning, everyone. Thank you all for coming. My name is Tang Xiaoming, come from <coughs> Huayan First Hospital, uh, affiliated to Nanjing Medical University. Uh, my hospital is a large uh, general hospital with 2,000 beds. Our vision is to provide a uh, um, place where patients, where patients could uh, receive a uh, good <coughs> uh, medical care, and a place where uh, medical students and um, residents could uh, acquire um, <coughs> uh, training and education in an ideal uh, uh, medical setting. Uh, this is my hospital's um, pictures. Um, today, <coughs> I'm going to speaking about the pedagogical school fixation through infractured vertebra in the treatment uh, circle number fractures. The primary goal of um, treatment of circle number fractures is to obtain uh, anatomical alignment of spinal columns. Now, <coughs> there are uh, several methods are used for treating sorical number fractures, uh, like uh, <clears throat> such as anterior approach, posterior short segment uh, fixed edging, uh, long segment uh, fixed edging, combined anterior and posterior approach. Currently, mm, sh short segment uh, pedicle school fixed edging is uh, very most in, uh, is uh, most common for using uh, treating circle number fracture. Uh, it's an indirect reduction. Um, it's um, use that use longitudinal distraction and get a <coughs> get a better direction. Uh, it's mainly used in air type A fracture. Uh, with intact anterior longitudinal ligament and posterior longitudinal uh, ligament. Uh, we can see the pictures uh, can get a good reduction with the technique. Uh, now I would like to talk about pedicle screw fixation in fractured vertebra. Uh, which is very popular in China. Uh, <clears throat> many uh, res researchers uh, concluded that the characteristics of sorical lumbar fractures. In most of the fractures, pedigrees in fractured vertebra were intact, and the bilateral pedigrees fracture was rare. The lower part of the body remained relatively intact. Okay, this is uh, Dr. King's biomechanical study. He, <clears throat> the results um, showed that the technique increased the stability of anti-bending and anti-rotation, minimizes the loss of correction, and aid fracture reduction. Uh, this is another biomechanical study, uh, the author Maha. Uh, concluded that um, the technique of improved biomechanical stability. This is the latest publication in 2014 from Jonet January uh, from a Turkish group. The also demonstrated that pedicle screw fixation combined with single screw in Fractured vertebra can be effective in the treatment of circle number fracture of type A. This is uh, type A. Okay, I'm going to show you some case studies. Uh, this is a male, 52 years old. He had L1 burst fractures with, uh, uh, by using the technique. Uh, 
we can see the picture. We achieved better reduction, obtained better crop angle, and the restoration of the anterior calling height. The rationality of the tech leg um, is based on the following factors. First, increase spinal stability and reduce instrumentation failure. Second, uh, resect the sagittal curve by direct pushing effect. Third, possible application to correct the rotational displacement of type B and C fractures. Uh, let me give a brief description about how we did the surgery. Uh, first, we placed uh, four pedicle screws on adjacent levels to distract and uh, get a reduction. If the patient have nerve um, deficit, we will do decompression. Uh, later, we remove <coughs> unilateral rod and place pedicle screw in the fractured vertebra. Uh, attention, the tip of the screw should reach the middle column. Uh, the lens is about uh, the screw length is about uh, 3 to 3.5 uh, centimeter and a small diameter. Uh, finally, we get the new destruction and uh, can achieve a better reduction. The technique has some advantages. Uh, first, three point fixation to reduce the suspension effect and uh, Kyphosis. Uh, second, enhance the stability of internal fixation system, intra and poster of the tuning. Uh, third, avoid excess, excessive destruction on the disc. Um, but the technique is not recommended for simple compression fractures and not suitable for bilateral severely injured pedicle. Uh, after we <clears throat> got um, good result uh, in the uh, by using the technique in the treatment of circle number uh, with type A, we uh, explored the technique in type B and C fractures, which uh, which um, satisfy, uh, satisfying uh, results. Uh, case one: This is male, 27 years old. L3 burst fracture, type, uh, type B3. Uh, we see the picture. <clears throat> uses, uh, when we use the technique, the fracture vertebra, vertebra get the good reduction and restore the height. Uh, restore the height. Uh, case two, this is an L5 burst fracture. Uh, preoperative X-ray. This is um, oh, you see the <coughs> left picture. Um, when we insert the four pedicle screw um, on the adjacent levels, but <coughs> but we can get the um, better reduction. The posterior of the fractured body uh, is not um, good. So uh, this is. Uh, our earliest case. <clears throat> so we think, uh, what should I do? Uh, we uh, later we insert the pedicle screw in fractured <coughs> vertebra. Uh, we get uh, the better reduction. Uh, we also use in type C fracture. The patient uh, uh, is L two three. Uh, burst fracture and dislocation. Okay, this is post-operative X-ray, but the the height of um, fractured uh, vertebra is not uh, um, very good. It's also type C fracture. Uh, <clears throat> this is uni, uh, we use unilateral uh, pedicle screw fixation. Uh, some researchers think that unilateral uh, fixation 
uh, can get the same result with uh, <coughs> bilateral fixation. Um, but now uh, it has been ongoing um, some controversy about uh, the technique. Some also think that screw placement may prevent the reduction of free bone fragment. Unclear anatomical landmarks may increase the difficulty of placing screw. Uh, when longitudinal traction applied, the body may be cut. Apart, uh, but um, for our experience, um, most of the patients can get the result. Um, in 1972, President Nixon visited to China. Uh, here's um, Nixon with uh, Premier Zhou's photos. Premier Zhou uh, was respected and esteemed by Chinese people. <clears throat> all over the country. Huai An is the hometown of uh, Premier Zhou. It's um, my hometown also. Uh, it's a very beautiful city. Uh, it's a very beautiful city with a history of 2,200 um, 2, years. Um, finally, I, finally, I like I would like to uh, take this opportunity to express my sincere appreciation to everyone. Uh, <clears throat> I have learned a great uh, lot from uh, other people during my stay in Swedish. Uh, thank you, and wish you all success in the future. Thank you. Thank you.